Hi, this is my binary marble adding machine. Um, it's inspired by another one you can find out about on YouTube, which is much better crafted. Um, anyway, let's just do a little demo. So to read the output of, or to read the output of this machine, you look at these little uh, triangles here. If you've got a marble here, that's a one in the output, a two in the output, a four in the output, and an eight in the output there. Um, and I'm just gonna start everything out these all flipped over that way. And to add numbers into this, we drop a marble up here. That would be adding a 1, or adding a 2, or adding a 4. So let's start by adding, I don't know, 1. Note that 1 is now set in the output bit. We'll add an additional 1, so we're now calculating 1 plus 1. The 1 bit cleared itself. The 2 bit is now set. Let's add another 1 to this, so this is 1 plus 1 plus 1. And our result now is 3, or 1 plus 2. Let's add a fourth one. OK, great. So it cleared the first two bits. The, the final bit is set there, representing a 4 in our output. And what we've just done here is count to 4 by 1. Um, OK, so we've seen what happens when you add 1s. Let's just add a 4 to the existing 4 that we already have. And we'll see what the output is there. Oh, it's an 8. There you have it. Um, so 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 4 equals 8. And that is the computation that we've just done with this little machine. So uh, before I wrap it up, I just wanted to point out that this is actually made entirely out of rubber bands, um, thumbtacks, popsicle sticks. There are a few little like six-sided dice. And there's some super glue and paper in there, as well as a few uh, sewing needles. But for the most part, it's entirely made out of household objects, which I think makes it kind of cool. So that's all. Um, I hope you enjoyed my little adding machine.